your number one gym to be. Stay strong, healthy, and fit. Get ready for your Fit 7-Eleven home workout. Hello, my name is Rebecca Bartel. Welcome to Fit711 YouTube channel. Obviously, I hope you had already a lot of joy joined the classes before. Functional training, upper body, core, everything what you have to get fit. And this is the 13th class and I thought we'll do chest and back today. So it's push and pull. You actually need kettlebells. So get prepared for the kettlebells. I have over here about 6 kilos. I have 8 kilos, 10, 12 and 20. If you need... Um, more weight, make sure you get that weight because if it's too less, we don't build really up muscles. So please, it's not a lot of repetitions. We want to have strength. And of course, you can take single ones. I'm not actually have everything with pairs. I just will do it with single kettlebells, mostly the main exercises, okay? So get prepared. You need your towel, you need your mat and grab some water and let's do the warm up and have some fun. 30 minutes, let's go, okay? Open your feet. Let's stretch to the side. Oh, give me a good stretch. Yes, lean over, pulling on your hand, wrist. Good, feel that lateral stretch. Good, are you ready for 30 minutes? Oh, good, stretch, yes. Back stretch, keep going. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Let's go to rotation, let's turn, yes. Shoulders in one line with your elbows, rotating your spine. Keep your hips for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Let's do some push to the side. Push to the side. Yep. Pushing your hands from left to right. And return back to the center. Good. Four, three, two. Relax over here. Good, roll your shoulders back. So you see my mat is traveling. Good, for four, for three, good. Two, and chest open and rotating your hand. And pull backwards, stretch your chest. Four, three, good. Two, we'll go a little bit further, grab your shoulder plates, bending your spine and open. Eight more. Seven, touch your shoulders. Six, extend your hip coming up for four, for three, good, for two, and let's go down, lower spine. Yep, do you remember the exercises? I'm trying to repeat them just to get good form with it and to feel better. Yes, for four, three, two, now swing your arms forward and backward. Open your fingertips, back in one line, good, keep going, for four, for three, good, for two, and let's go down, hold it, and open your feet, yes, turn up, yes, keep your speed, not too fast, a little bit slower, booty slow, look to your hand, good, for four, one more the other side, good, coming up, and hand wrist, good. So guys, get prepared, we're starting with a Romanic deadlift, there is the weight, okay, it will be always back and chest, okay, and we will do three sets, here is the weight, you know which exercise it is, open your feet, and going downwards with the kettlebell between your knees. Ready, here we go. It's your lower spine, okay? Try to get some weight what's not too hard at the beginning to warm up, okay? Down and up. Remember, we're still in upper body, no squatting. Yes, eyes are following the movement. Good. Give me two more reps, let's go. One more. Good, go down. We're starting with push-ups today. No weight, please. Basic push-ups. Inhale, exhale for a couple of seconds. Ready for 12. Spreading your fingertips. In four, three, two, let's push. Down and up, down and up. 10 to go. Nine, 
Last eight reps. Eight. Come up. Seven. Come up. Six. Yes. Single push-ups. For four. Keep going. Three. Good. Two. And one. Good job. So are you sure? If you feel it's too hard, go a little bit backward to level one. Take your knees, of course. But make sure you have that full range of motion in your push-ups. So guys, here's more weight. Same exercise. Romanic deadlift, take more weight. I have 20 kilos. It is too less. Don't handle, don't have with less weight. Take more weight if you want to. Ready? Four, three, two. Down. So now we're adding a little bit more speed because you know the exercise. Good. Push your booty back. Down. Up. So romantic deadlift is one of the most important strength exercises, training your back chain. Good. And coming up, activating your glutes. Good. Shoulders back. Down. Up. Let's do two more reps. Ready? Let's go. Down. Up. Good. How's the weight? Good job. Going back to push-ups. Today we're not really changing the exercise in between the sets. Just three normal sets. Okay, you ready? What you can do is just go lower, give your best. Starting with no knees for six. And if you feel tired, go back to your knees. But make sure you're adding 12 reps to your workout. 12. 11. 10, 9, keep going, 8, yes, core is tight, push and back, training chest and shoulders, 4, 3, good, 2, 1, good job, Woo! third set, I will take the same weight because I'm sure what's happening afterwards is still romantic deadlift, single arm, so take both hands, we show it to you to the side. Look, kettlebells pulling your shoulders in front. Make sure you're keeping that posture, training your shoulder plates, chest out, shoulders back. Let's go. 12. Good. Keep your knees bent. 10. 9. Elbows are straight. 7. Extend your hip. 6. Push your booty back. 5 to go. Yes. Eyes are following the movement. Chin away from your chest. Two more. Down. Yes. Do you feel a little bit stretching your hamstrings? Perfect. And come up. So hamstrings and glutes are training also with your domestic deadlift, but mainly the power is coming from your lower spine. Let's go. You ready? I'm ready. And let's push. Go. 12. Come on. 11. Good. 10. Excellent. You're coming up. 9. Keep going. Eight. Come up. Seven. Come up. Six. Don't quit. Five. Just four reps. Four. Pick it up. Three. Pick it up. Two. And one more. Good job. So remember I said we'll go afterwards to single arm. We will go for single arm now. I will take 12 kilos. But make sure you decide how you feel, which weight you want to take. So now we're going to 12 each side. Same exercise. Coming up. Let's go. Yes. So it's no problem to add a fourth or fifth set or sixth set, but you can change from unilateral to bilateral, so single arm. Good. Keep the spine in one line. Four to go. Up. Three, good. Up, two more. Two, last one. Down, good, you switch the hand. Shoulder plates back, go down. Remember, no squatting. I just want you to feel your lower spine. Keep going. So I'm going with the kettlebells to my foot and coming up, extending my hip, chest, yes. Four. Three, good. Two, and one more. Good, good job. So we're going back to push, going to a lower plank. So we have adding more core to it. Going to the floor, 
It will be eight each hand. So we're starting with the right hand, coming to up and down, coming to your plank. Right hand, left hand. Yes. Speed, go up, down, up, down, up, down. Yes, keep going, push yourself. Push up and down. Slowly down with left, up with left. Down and speed, let's go. One, down, two, down, three, down, four, down, five. Last one, pick it up. Yes. So this is push. Well, we will do push also with the kettlebells. But we will focus on chest today, okay? So I need one more set. We'll do two sets of single arm, rowing, leaning forward. Let's go. Are you ready? Woo! Yes, short break. Keep the tension up. Burning more calories. Yes. Training endurance. Let's go for six more. Six. Good. Five. Push the booty back. Yes, you feel that lower spine over here. Here is the power. I need two more. Two. One more. Yes, good job. Change your hand. Ready? Let's go. Oh, now I'm feeling my back muscles. You too, let's go. Eight. Back. Seven. Keep your knees slightly bent. Leaning forward. Meanwhile, you're going forward with your head. Your hips are pushing back. It's so one movement from glutes and head in one line. Yes. Give me two more. Two more. Last one. Down. And let's go to the plank. Yes. So if you feel like having a longer break, no problem, just press break and make sure you go back to play, okay? So here I am, backward. Uh, let's go down. Okay, ready for it? For four, three, give me your right hand in single. Up, down, up, down. I'm placing my hand while my elbows is laying before. Come on, two more, up, Keep your core tight, up, switch hand, left, up, yes, come on, let's go, woo, four to go, let's go, four, three, two, one more, down and up, good job, woo, strong core, okay, so guys, let's go to chest, I'll go to back. We'll do rowing again. We'll go for renegade row. So the kettlebell is over here. Watch for my leg. I'm turning my foot into that position. Straight leg, 90 degrees in the front leg. Taking the handle to my person. But if I'm pulling up, make sure the goal is to pull the kettlebell in this part of your ribs, okay? So I'm rotating a bit, my shoulders are open, and going back, you ready? Up, down, up, down. Single arm row, eight to go, let's go. Eight, extend, seven, extend, six, yes. Pull higher, come on, four, back, three, back, two, back, and one. Good job, switch side. Hey, Mr. G. Jake. Woo lower, lower, lower. I'm taking my time to give us a rest. Okay, ready? Here we go. Keep on going. Let's go. 12, back, 11, 10, yes, 9, keep lower, 8, pull, yes, pull. Come on, higher, 4, Three, good. Two, one more. Everybody Up, moves. good job. So here is the Everybody chest. Moves. I need kettlebells, Everybody a pair of kettlebells. Going to the floor on your backside working Everybody position. So what's important, if you have the kettlebells, don't drop them behind you because it's injury mostly for your shoulders. Protect your shoulders, 
keeping your lower spine pressed to the floor. Feet together. And let's go push. Chest press. Good. Up, down. Okay, make sure kettlebells are coming together above your chest and above your head. You want to train your chest. Eight, seven, six. Keep going. Five. And push. Woo! Keep the balance of your kettlebells. Up, down. Let's do two more. Up, down, up. Watch. Now you're putting it into your body, not into the outside. Keeping it safe. Let it slowly drop to the floor. Don't let it fall. Okay, so I'm happy with my weight. I have 10 kilos. But actually, you want to challenge yourself, or right? So never be satisfied. Let's go for more weight. Woohoo! In four, three, two, let's roll. 12, yes, 11. Come on, pull slowly down. Pull slowly down. Eight, down, seven, higher. Six, you wanna train your back. Open, let's go. Four, come on. Three, two to go. Two, and one, good job. Woo, relax. Did you take more weight? Let's do that together. Other side. Don't change the weight, don't go left. Same, lay, same side, same weight, the other side. Not changing the weight if you change the side. Ready, let's go. 12, slowly down, 11, come on. 10, nine, excellent, you're coming up. Yes, six to go. Come on, just four more reps, let's pull. Pull slowly down. Three, two to go. Two, one more, up. Yes, how was it with more weight? It's always possible. If you give your best, you will see how much energy you have left. So, chest press. Okay, so there is it. I just have the six kilos. If you have eight kilos as a peer, you can take eight, 10 or 12, but I just have them two over here. So that's fine for me, it's still heavy. You're smiling at the moment if I say it's heavy with six. <laughs> Let's go. Up, down, up, down, up. Okay, you see my arms are touching the floor to 90 degrees, not let your kettlebells drop inside. Keep it in one line to the floor. Let's go. Yes. Guys, I need your spine pushing to the floor, protecting your spine. Let's go. Four, down, three, down. Okay, you have 12. I will do three more because the weight is not too heavy. If you're with me, just go with two more now. Last one, and up. Good job. Okay, let's go up. So, okay, I will change a quite of variations that you can see what can happen. I will do now single arm roll, alternating but coming from a squat. Okay, so this is, I will start with 10 kilos first. We'll do two sets of it, okay? So, this is the position you're standing. Handle in that position, thumbs over here in front, and rowing up, leaving a drop, and switch, let's go. Keep your back in one line. Yes, belly button is in, protecting your spine, row. Good. Pull, pull, pull. Chill away from your chest. Yeah, come on. Pull. 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 Four to go. Four. Three. Pull, one more. Yes, good job. Wonderful. Okay, what we can do now is to take more weight and go for a single arm. Chest press. So this is a lot of variations to make it a little more heavier or coordination. Okay, you ready? I have 10, I add more weight. Arms over here. Now you see, thumb is inside, pointing to your chest. 12. Now you see, it's coordination and balance from your upper body, what is now the focus on. Let's go. 
Guys, it's heavy. Okay, come on. Good. Slowly down, protecting your shoulders. Come on, four to go. Four, three, don't stop. Two, and one more. You feel that chest now. Slowly down. Watch where you're leaving your kettlebells. Turning it again. Okay, you ready? Woo, shaky, shaky, shaky. It's heavy. Ready, let's go. One, down, up, down, yes. You can take your speed, I need eight more. Eight, seven, exhale, pushing up the kettlebells. Woo, shaking again, I need two more. If I'm shaking my arms, you know my weight is heavy. Ugh. Good job. Woo. I'm coming up, you coming up, and commitment. More weight. What do we have? 12? Yeah, that's good. Okay, you see what I'm doing? This is a good place to see how far is the distance from your feet. I will take my mat. Now I'm leaning downward. You see the spine is coming here to protect my lower spine. Keeping the core tight. Four, and head. Eyes on one meters in front of the line to make sure chills away from your chest. And let's go. One, down. Two, down. Three, pull up. Four, let's go. Five, six, seven, eight. Keep going. If you feel your lower spine, just pull your hip to your belly button. Yes, not too much extension from your lower spine. Pull, elbows to the roof. Pull, slowly down, pull. Let's go. Ready for four more. Four, three, two, one. Good job. Okay, you wanna have more weight. Actually, we'll do that. Okay. Oh, I remember at 10 kilos. I think that was good. 12, okay, 12. But you go also higher with your weight, okay? Let's do that together. You and me. Okay, my goal is to go for eight. If I'm trying to go for 10, I will do 10. If I'm trying to go for 12, I will do 12. Let's see what's happening. Ready? Up, down, up. Down, three, four, five, push. Six, core is tight, seven, eight. Four more, eight, you have. 10, 11, and 12, yes. Burn the 12 kilos, woo. Turn, four, three, two, let's go for the other arm. 12 reps, feet is close. Nine, eight, keep going. Seven, you're doing great. It's your workout. Come on. Push, four to go, I think four. Slowly down, three, control the kettlebell. Two, and one. Good job. Ooh, this is heavier. Guys, we have five minutes to go. So, we have the rowing. You have back, you have the deadlift, you have the row, you have the here, you have the renegade row. We did last time, last week we did the plank with the rowing. So now we'll do less weight. Upper body, it's upper part of the back and behind is shoulders. So let's go for shoulders, upper part, pull back. You see that elbow to the side? Thumbs inside, ready, let's go. Pull, back, pull, back. Elbows to the side, pull, let's go. Four, three, two, slowly down, and one, good job. So chest, chest, chest. Okay, let's go down. Woo, I will take the last weight now. Okay, going back. Now this is what you can do. You can do 
slice if the weight is less enough. Let's go. Lower spine to the floor. Elbows touching floor and coming back. Come on, come on. I know somebody will ask now, oh, there's no range downwards. But if you're sure you have a good technique, you will feel the upper body. You will feel the upper part of your chest pressing the muscles together. Keep the elbows bent, please. Let's go. Four. So the movement is chest coming from your shoulder joint, elbow stiff, two to go. Press them together above your chest. Last one, control, and together. Good job. Woo! So this is perfect weight for me because I want to go over here to the side. Not in here, you see the elbows? Four, feet together. Okay, ready, let's pull. One, back, two, back. Pull back. If you have a mirror, watch for the mirror. If the spine is straight, elbows to the side. Back. Let's do four more. Four, three, two, and one. Good job. Woohoo! Flies. Ready? Second set. Let's go. Yes. So if you're wondering where's the break, you don't have to actually do a break in between because you're doing supersets. Let's go. Slow, do you see the tempo is less because this is a balance. What is the challenge? You get that line to your chest, pressing your shoulders inside to get your chest together, training your upper body. And push, yes, slowly down. Keep going. Press them together. Yes, good. We'll do two more. Let's go. Last one. Good job. So this is the last set. Come up, come up, come up. Exhale. Position in four, three, two. Let's go. 12, 11. We have 30 minutes in two minutes. Come on. Don't quit now, we we'll just finish in a couple of minutes, seconds, whatever. Here's the work, get it done. Pull, six to go. Six, let's count. Five, let's count. Four, how much? Three, let's go. Two, and one, good job. <laughs> I'm so happy always with the last set. Good job, guys, and four, three, two, let's go. Up. Eight. Seven. Spine low to the floor. Let's do two more reps of the flies. Last one is coming now. Good. Come up. Good job. YouTube, Fit711, Rebecca Bart. Thanks for joining the 13th class. See you next week on Sundays, number 14. Good job, guys. Too soon. Bye.